Dotco has undoubtedly been one of the biggest success stories of the internet world in the past decade. How did the idea of launching Dotco come to you? Well, at the most basic level, a uh, web address is, is the first thing anybody needs to get online. It's, it's, your, it's, it's where people go to see your online presence. So as an entrepreneur uh, in the late 90s, early 2000s, I was challenged by the fact that I couldn't find a, a credible short web address to get online with because everything else had been taken. So at that point in time back then, I realized there would be a huge opportunity in coming up to the market with something, uh, a new alternative that would solve that, that problem. That co came around uh, in 2006, 2008. It, it shaped up as an opportunity. I got involved in the process and went for it with everything I had. Uh, we formed a great team, uh, put together a great team, and, and uh, won a bid to run .co um, and market it worldwide. It's only been a little over a year since the launch of .co, so help us to understand the numbers. How many .co domain names are actually registered today in how many countries? Sure, the, the growth has been phenomenal. Over 1.2 million web addresses. Keep in mind, we launched a little, uh, little over a year ago in, on June 20th of 2010 and we're spread all over the world. About 26% of, of those registrations are, are in the UK and Europe, Europe alone. Uh, everything ranging from small and medium-sized businesses to startups uh, to large companies like Google and Twitter who are using the .co domain. So over a million .co names registered by people in over 200 countries. To what do you attribute the success you've enjoyed since your launch? Yeah, well, I, I mean, I guess three things, so three distinct things. One is we have a great product, .co. It stands for company all over the world, it's, and it's short. In the world of social media uh, and search engines, that is very important. So a great product. Number two, we've been very aggressive in marketing, particularly to our target market, again, which are entrepreneurs and small and medium-sized businesses. We've done everything from a Super Bowl ad. We're doing one again uh, this February uh, 2012. Uh, to billboards on in Times Square and Union Square in San Francisco. And, and lastly, I would go back to the team. The team of people we've put in place is phenomenal. Now anyone who's tried to register a .com name in recent years can testify that .com is a crowded space. Besides simply being more available than .com, what other benefits does using .co have for companies? Sure, absolutely. I think there are two core benefits. One is that it's short. In the world of social media, sharing, Twitter, your web address needs to be short. .co offers you that alternative. Two, in the world of mobile, short is very, very important. You want people to be able to type in your web address very quickly and, and, and get, have access to your website. And lastly, on search engines, it's, in, it's very important to show up on the top of the search results. .co makes it easy for you to uh, accomplish that. So who's using .co? Give us some examples. Absolutely, it's, it's wide ranging. It starts from big brands like Google uh, and Twitter, who are, uh, Twitter in the case of Twitter is using t.co, to small and medium sized businesses. For example, quarterly.co in New York is a very cool website. Uh, other examples here in, in the UK, Charlotte Church, a famous musician who's using charlottechurch.co. Rio Ferdinand, a famous footballer from, from Manchester United. He has a digital lifestyle magazine called 5mag.co. It's very cool. And it also a big company like Aspen Insurance, Aspen.co. Those are all comp good examples of, of who's using .co right now. It's been a phenomenal growth story since the launch of .co. So what does the future hold for you? Um, well, our goal, our principal goal is ensuring that the next Facebook, the next Twitter, the, the next Google is built in a .co domain. That day we will know we, we will have been successful. Juan Diego Calle, thank you very much. Thank you.